Hey guys, Michael here. Uh, you might know me as On The Clouds on Instagram. Uh, so I just thought I would start a little YouTube channel to talk about things that I feel are important, uh, things that I feel people should know, and just throw out some reviews and get my little two cents out there about what's going on and what I feel people should know. So let's get right into it. And the first thing I wanted to talk about today is this guy right here. Uh, this is a 120ml bottle of Belgian waffle. This comes from vapejuice.com. Uh, this was around $14.99 right now. Uh, and it's it's lovely. I love it. Uh, it Alright, so these juices are made, uh, f made to order. So as soon as you order them, they start making your juice. Uh, you get it in about... Uh, a, a little under a week, a little under a week it took for this guy to get here, uh, and I ordered this during Christmas time too, so it it took a little bit longer, but it genuinely takes about a week to get to you. Um, this is a 70-30 PGVG blend, 3 milligrams of nicotine, how I like to vape, um, and it's fantastic. It, it's, it's lovely. Uh, like I said, it's made fresh to order, so when you get it, you're going to want to let it steep a little bit. Uh, the recommended steep time for your juice, if you have a fruity flavor, it's more uh, two to three days to let it steep. Or, or if you have a desserty flavor, a thicker flavor, you're going to want to let it steep for four to seven days. Uh, I've been streathing mine, a little process I use. Uh, uh, shout out to a few UV, uh, YouTube vapors out there who game the inside on this uh, I streathe it um, and I've been doing that for about a week with this and it came out amazing it, it's fantastic and for the price you can't beat it it it's lovely and I vape this all the time all the time uh, I'm gonna take a little toot we'll talk about the flavor of this and uh, so let's, uh, let's take a two. I'm vaping it right now on a Hobo RDA with a 0.9 super macro coil, single coil in here. Uh, I'm vaping this at around, let's see if you can see that, around 37 watts, 5.8 volts. All right, let's take a little two, talk about it. Mm. I love this juice. I really do. I love it. Love this juice. Um, so right right off the bat, you get the waffly, the, the waffleness. Uh, you get a little bit of syrupy kind of flavor in there, and then towards the exhale, uh, mid exhale, you get kind of a sweet strawberry, maybe a little whipped cream in there, and it's it's so good. It's so good. I just. I wanted to talk about this because I feel everybody needs to know about these guys. They're awesome people. Awesome, awesome people. I've talked to Shane. Um, he actually um, emailed me uh, the other day, wanted some advice on his sub tank. Couldn't find a build he liked for it. Gave him a little, gave him a little tip. Um, and I've talked to a few customer service reps. They have a little chat thing on their website so if you have a question you just automatically ask their uh, customer service rep who's on the other line waiting for you um, great people great person great customer service very personable awesome company awesome deals I really recommend going to check these guys out vapejuice.com I'll leave a link in the description as to where you can buy this juice all right so the second thing I wanted to talk about today is a product I got a little, a little, a little under, or a little over a week ago, um, and I wake up, I vape it, I grab for it all the time. It's constantly with me, and never leave home without it. And that product is the Kanger Sub Tank. This guy right here. I'm currently using this with the rebuildable head in it. Got a eh, 0.5, 0.6 ohm dual coil in here. Just a little 26 gauge, five six four five wrap, uh, and it vapes. Great, I got I'm got cut woods boss reserve in here. That is six. All right, let me just show you the performance off this guy on a mechanical mod with a freshly charged battery. Okay. 
and I, I usually keep the air holes at the moderate setting, two air holes open. I like it more restrictive, uh, real nice draw, and the flavor on this thing is amazing. It's spot on. Um, it's fantastic. I uh, I can taste every little hint of flavor in the Boss Reserve. I get even the bananas at the end uh, spot on. It was fantastic. And, um, yeah. So this thing, fucking awesome. Fucking awesome device. It's fantastic. It holds um, with the pre-made pre OCC coils in here. It holds around 5 to 5.5 millime milliliters of juice. This guy in here holds maybe 2 to 2.5 milliliters of juice. Um, it's fantastic. I love it. I love it. Um, uh, I have had a few friends have problems with theirs, um, but nothing too major. Little tip, the OCC coils that come with it aren't the best yet. They're, they 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 do kind of they say they're supposed to last longer than an Atlantis coil. They don't. They really don't. Uh, my point five coil blew out in four days. I that's just my personal use of it, my experience, and a few of my friends have had some bad experiences with their coils. And a little uh, a little tiff with the rebuildable section, but so far. Uh, we've got all the problems solved, and then everybody's loving theirs, and I'm, I'm loving mine. It's fantastic. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it so much. It's a great product. Um, not really doing like a full review on any of this stuff. I just kind of want to get this out there, talk about it, give my two cents on, on these products, and yeah, just kind of get my opinions out there on it. Um, let's take a look at the box with this thing, cause. That's what really impressed me uh, right off the bat about this guy. Let me just grab for that. Don't mind my reach. All right, here's the box. The Kanger sub tank comes in. Okay, let's just slide this up. Ooh, how pretty is that? Isn't that lovely? You get this guy right here, little Kanger sub tank on there. Okay, then you just kind of grab this part. Let's see if I can do this. Gonna grab this part, slide it out, dropping things now. Alright, inside it's gonna come with a little a, a little attention, a little slip telling you to pre-drip your coils before you use them. So I, I feel that's a pretty good thing to include in there. Not everybody knows that. I mean if you're buying this at a vape shop, they should tell you that kind of stuff. But just in case, and if you're ordering this offline, a little warning for you. Comes with a product authenticity ticket and a little little how-to guide, little user's guide on this thing, how to use it. All right, so you get into here and you pull pull this apart like so. You got this in here, and now right here I've got my 1.2 ohm uh, OCC coil. Okay, this guy right here. This is the OCC coil chimney. So when you put the re the pre-built coils in here, you're gonna take this part off and put this one in because it, it, it's it's a bit longer than the other one because the rebuildable head stands up. Um, and then you get some extra screws, some extra coils, and a screwdriver and a little bit of organic cotton fantastic i love the packaging on this thing it's just so cool um so yeah that's pretty much all i have to say all there's really to talk about today right now uh i'm gonna take a little toot uh and yeah let's just take one more toot and i'll get you guys out of here loving that vape juice belgian waffle all right guys thank you for joining me today i really appreciate the views i'd love it if you guys would like and subscribe uh more videos coming out soon hopefully i'll get better at this as we go uh so there's my two cents thanks for watching guys have a great day and remember vape safe